I'd like to make an unusual garment, decorated with fringe. I'm glad that I've decided to show you this tutorial. I think that it's going to be very interesting. I've already shown you how to make Chanel style fringe yourself. Watch the videos if you haven't done it yet. Today I'm going to make a vest. I've already cut it according to my basic pattern. Have a look at it. There are no side seams in the garment. When the chest darts are stitched, I'll only have to sew these parts. The bottom and the bottom stand are already etched. We did it off the camera so that we can start decorating the garment. Today I'm going to show you how to decorate the lower part. And in the next videos I'll decorate the upper part. Let's have a look at the decorative details. These are the double layer fringe stripes. The width of the lower stripe is 6 cm. And the upper one is 4.5 cm. Today I'd like to show you how to make such fringe. I'm going to apply the stripes to the garment and fix them with a the fusible material. I'm going to attach them this way. I share my ideas with you, and you can change the designs I show you however you like. I want you to learn to use your imagination. Don't be afraid of experiments. I'd like to apply the white double layer stripes on the bottom, and the narrow stripes will be placed on the top. They will be 3 cm wide. The white stripes will make the garment stronger at the bottom. I'm going to combine this cut again with trousers, skirts or blouses, with my black dress. It will suit many different garments from my wardrobe. I will also decorate the stripes with pearls or beads. I'm sure that they would look amazing. I'm not sure how many pearls I'm going to attach. We'll decide it later. I hope you've learned how to make a pattern for a dress with no side seams in it from the previous video. This comment was cut according to the same pattern. Let's start making decorative details. The two stripes are ready. I'd like to show you how to make them. When all of the details are ready, I'll attach them to the garment. I'm glad that I can show you some unusual, creative garments. These details can be moved aside. We've made them off the camera. I need to cut two stripes to make one decorative detail. The width of the first stripe should be 6.5 cm and the second one 4.5 cm. Of course, you can make it different. Decorate it with pearls, beads, chains. I don't recommend you combining Chanel style fabric with rhinestones. Be creative. Attach horizontal stripes on the bottom and top and vertical ones on the waistline. Try leaving some transparent parts in between the stripes. In this case, the garment would look absolutely amazing. I'm cutting the stripe, which is 6.5 cm wide. You can cut it on a bias. You can make different types of fringe. Decorate fringe with chains or chiffon tapes. 
Use your imagination. I've already shown you how to do it in the videos about making Chanel style fringe. This stripe is 6.5 cm wide. And next, I need to cut one more, 4.5 cm wide. Double layered fringe stitched to the bottom makes the garment much stronger. It's convenient to cut this fabric according to the drawn lines. I've cut two stripes. I like this fabric. It frays easily. It's very convenient to work with it. If you cut the details on the bias, you can make the fringe with the use of a needle. It's not hard to do it. I need to pull the threads out carefully. I've cut the stripes on the lengthwise grain. Make the details as long as you want. It's up to you. Let's have a look at the result. I've pulled some threads out. I really hope that you like this idea. You can repeat after me or make a different decoration. Add chains or chiffon stripes to these details. You can make very unusual decoration. Be creative. We are also going to use the fusible material. Here it is. Have a close look at what I'm doing now. Put one detail on top of the other, and next I need to join them. I'll use fusible material for doing it. When it's done, we will start decorating the vest. Have a look at this stripe. I need to fix two stripes together. You can make single layered fringe. But I want to make the bottom of the garment stronger. I'm going to use the fusible material, put it in between the two stripes, and then press them. Be sure to use the high-quality fusible material. Yeah. 
Have a look at the way I'm working. I'm going to decorate the bottom with the five double layer stripes. The other stripes will be single layered. The decorative detail is almost ready. Shake it this way. That's it. It looks very beautiful. I have five double layer stripes. I'm going to apply them to the garment. I'll show you how to do it in the next video. Of course, you can make different decorations. But if you have a Chanel style skirt, you can decorate a jacket or a vest with such stripes. The suit would look amazing in this case. How to decorate the vest with it? First. I need to iron the vest. Natalie has cut the fusible material off the camera. She's cut 4.5 cm wide stripes. I need to attach the first one. I want to apply it to the bottom in such way that the edge is visible. This way. You can see that the bottom edge is clearly seen. Press it from the right side gently first, and then press it harder from the wrong side. Make sure to attach the fusible material accurately. The vest is going to be unusual and very beautiful. I can combine it with different garments from my wardrobe. If you want to have some special garments, be creative. Chanel creates so many unusual garments. I'd like to show you some of them. I'll talk to you about the Chanel style in one of the next videos. Have a close look at the way I'm attaching the fringe. You can sew the stripes to the vest if you want to. I've decided not to waste my time doing it, and use fusible material instead. Oh, 
The first stripe is ready. This is how it looks like now. I'll show you what to do with it later. I need to press it from the wrong side harder. The first one is ready. Don't worry if the edge is free, it's okay. Due to the decoration, the vest is going to be pretty strong. Next, I need to apply the second stripe. I remind you that the vest itself is made of organza. I'll attach it this way. I'm doing it by sight. I need to take the stripe of the fusible material Join the details this way and apply them to the vest. The distance between the two stripes is about 1.5 cm. The organza fabric should be clearly seen. Make sure that the fusible material doesn't move. You can draw the lines if you want to. I show you everything in detail. Be very careful when cutting the extra pieces. I like such creative designs. I'm so happy to be able to share my ideas with you. I'm working with silk organza. If you have synthetic one, be very careful not to burn it with an iron. I'll show you how to apply one more stripe. In the next video, you'll see how to apply narrow stripes. In the next video, you'll see how to apply narrow stripes. If you like creativity, I'm sure that you'll enjoy the process. It's actually pretty interesting. Decorate the garments however you want. I need to be very careful when applying the stripes. 
I'm doing it by sight. I think that the vest is going to be very beautiful. I'm not going to show you how to jump holes. I think that you already know it. We'll do it off the camera. And we'll continue working with the vest in the next video. I've seen a similar decoration in Sadros collection, and I realized that I needed such vest. I am happy that I have an opportunity to show you this lesson of creativity. I want you to learn to use your imagination. I want you to not be afraid of experiments. It doesn't take much time to do what I'm doing now. I'm going to attach two mobile stripes off the camera. I've already applied the white stripes. Natalie has edged the armholes and stitched the chest darts and the side tucks. We can continue decorating. Please, be creative. Think of different designs. Use your imagination. In the next video, I'll show you the Finnish garment and its combination with trousers, a dress and a skirt. The vest will suit a lot of garments from my wardrobe. I can't wait to try it on. I've applied four white double layer stripes. I've decided not to attach the fifth one. The following stripes are single layered. They are 5 cm wide. The distance between the stripes will be 2 cm. I'm going to distribute the stripes first and then attach them with an iron. I remind you that the distance between the white stripes was 1.5 cm. I need to mark the location of the stripes. 
И я позову Наташу, Наташа будет нам помогать. The stripes on top of the vest will be even tighter, and the distance between them bigger. It wouldn't be right to attach these stripes by sight. Apply them this way, and then draw the marks. The vest is going to be so beautiful. The following stripes will be 4 cm wide. I'd just like to show you the general idea. I wanted to understand that you can apply this idea to different garments. You can decorate a skirt this way. Or a jacket. A jacket can be combined with a top. Or you can make a similar vest and wear it on top of a dress. These stripes are 4 cm wide. I can't wait to see the result. I gave up on the idea of decorating the stripes with beads. I think that it would be too much. But if you like it, you can add some other decorative details. The distance between these stripes should be bigger. I'm doing everything by sight. I enjoy this creative process. I don't often have such opportunity. I think that the vest is going to be very beautiful. These three stripes are 5 cm wide, and the next ones are 4 cm wide. We've already stitched the chest darts. Take it into consideration. I want to make the distance between these stripes even bigger. The distance between these stripes is 3 cm. We'll attach the details stripe by stripe. I just want to show you the general idea. Very well. These stripes are just 3 cm wide. The fusible material for them will be 1 cm wide. The distance between these stripes will be 4 cm. When I finish distributing the stripes, I'll call Natalie for help. Very nice. The distance between the first stripes is 1.5 cm, then 2 cm, 3 cm, and the distance between the top stripes is 4 cm. The vest is going to be very beautiful. I already love it. I'm so happy that I can finally share this idea with you. I've been thinking about making such vests for about a year. 
Next, I need to detach the stripes and then apply them one by one. We are going to finish decorating today. In the next video, I'll show you a review of the finished garment. I'll show you how I'm going to combine it with different garments. Have a closer here. We've pinned the fusible material to the stripes. Natalie will take the pins out before pressing. Anyway, it makes the work easier. We've cut the stripes of different width. I recommend you thinking about such things in advance. In this case, you wouldn't waste time thinking about it while working. As I've said, we've pinned the pieces of the fusible material to each of the stripes. Next, I need to mark the location of each stripe. Two centimeters here. I need to measure and mark two centimeters up from the attached detail. Apply each stripe this way. I need to check the distance down to the bottom. 32 cm here. And 32 cm here. Very well. I can apply the next stripe now. Natalie is going to help me. Do not forget to take the pins out. Stretch your gants a bit, but do not stretch the stripes. They shouldn't gather the fabric. Be very attentive. Apply the stripes according to the marks and take the pins out. I love working with Natalie. She's an amazing tailor. Try to make it even. The detail should be accurate. Let's move on to the second stripe. Make sure to spread the fabric thoroughly. The edges will fray. It would look very nice. The vest will be light and at the same time pretty strong. I love it. It's going to be very beautiful. Have a look here. We've attached almost all of the stripes. We'll finish doing it off the camera. 
In the next video, we'll give you a review of the Finnish garments. We'll show you its combination with trousers, skirts, dresses. I believe that it's clear now how to make this decoration. I hope that you like this technique and my idea will inspire you to create different designs with similar decoration. You can change the design however you like. Attach beads, pearls, chains, whatever you want. Try to be creative. Use your imagination and do not be afraid of experiments. I'll show you some of the combinations. My new black shoes suited very well. Stiletto heels or boots will suit it either. If I combine it with another dress, it would look absolutely different. I can wear the vest with trousers, a skirt and a shirt. I'm satisfied with the result. The vest is absolutely wonderful. As for the fusible material, we don't usually use it for sewing but it's suitable for such creative work. The stripes are attached reliably with it. You can hardly tear them off. Please, be creative. We've attached the details with the fusible material. You can stitch them to fabric. You can decorate them with chains, pearls or beads. It's up to you. I think that the fusible material is good enough for me. Any of the variants will be right. It's just a matter of choice. I like that the stripes are of different width. The distance between the stripes gets bigger to the top. It makes the vest look very unusual. Have a close look at this outfit once again. I'm going to change it next. You can make a similar vest or a cardigan with sleeves or decorate the front of your dress with similar stripes. Make decorative details of different form, rectangular, square and so on. Be creative. I'm glad that I can finally bring my idea to life. And I'm happy with the result. Do not be afraid of experiments. You've seen that it didn't take me long to make this vest. Have a look at me. I'm wearing the vest on top of the trousers and my favorite black shirt. The collar, the sleeves and the boots are decorated with the rhinestones. The vest used them well. What do you think? I like the way the vest moves together with me. Organza is delicate and the stripes make it heavier and stronger. This is a very unusual outfit. I'm sure that I will be able to combine the vest not only with black garments, but with other colors as well. This vest will help me be different and beautiful every day. I'll turn around. This is a plain shirt collar. I love both the shirt and the trousers. As I've said, I got this idea a very long time ago. I knew that I had to make it. Let me show you one more combination. The shirt is the same. The pencil skirt and white shoes look fresh. I'm sure that such an unusual vest will make you and your life more interesting. 
They are in such vest, you will always be in the spotlight. That's all for today. Let's be different and beautiful every day together. This is what I'm here for. My name is Irina Paukšte. Buy my courses, subscribe to my channel, write comments, share the videos, press the like and the bell buttons. I would really appreciate your support. Thank you. Goodbye.